So I dare say this is probably a male. You can tell by all the dings and bashes and stuff like that. He looks old. Yeah. Yeah, and that's old too. Yeah, it's probably, you know, you usually hang around the water. Yeah, well, yeah, there's a creek so close. That's what I was saying when we were coming in. I was asked, uh, Red Valley Territory here. His head's just, just there. Hey guys, so just coming to an end of the uh, catch video. Thanks very much for watching. Thanks for staying to the end. Now, I just want to show you guys a couple little... Um, oh, I'm pretty sure this has either been a snake that someone has intentionally tried to kill or it's a male that has been absolutely flogged by other bigger males. Um, if you can get a good camera angle on the left-hand side of the snake here where my hook is, it's got a mad wound right there i'll zoom in as much as i can in editing as well also missing some scales on this side you got another wound on the right side of his body as well uh, again looks relatively old from what we can see a few scales missing as well unfortunately uh look there's not a whole lot we can really do about this one he's, he's perfectly fine he's moving fine um Taking him to a vet is just not necessary for this snake. Um, there's not a whole lot they'll do. They'll just look at it and release him because he's completely fine. So uh, yeah, we're going to release him at this little creek area here. and see if we can get him swimming. You got it? Mm -hmm. Wrong way. That's not the exit I was hoping for. Where's he going? Yeah, he's just disappeared into that. And that is a good example on why you should always wear long pants and boots. If we were to walk through here and not know, we've just put a red belly here. Obviously this isn't a walking path or anything like that. It's a national creek. Um, but yeah, look, if, if we were to walk through and accidentally step on him, that is when bites occur. So um, always wear boots when you're out hiking, always wear long pants. I know it's hot, but safety should always come first. Thanks for watching guys. See you guys on the next one. Hey guys, so just coming to an end of... ...healed over, thankfully, but that's a pretty big indent. Uh, so, yeah, I don't know whether, you know, something like a lawnmower or something's hit it and it's bolted, you know, there's many, many possibilities. But I do believe that this is a male that's had quite a few fights with other male red bellies in the past. So I've got a beautiful spot to release him here. And uh, are we done? Absolutely.
Um, there's a gash on this side as well where he's missing some scales.